I usually like to stay on the Mexican side of my midget trip, but uh, that beer is goddamn near the sexiest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. Yeah, no, you know, I was grabbing his meat, and you know, I, I, I don't know why I did it, and I thought he was a midget. He, just, he wasn't even a midget, he was just a short man. And, Hey, you got a pretty mouth, but this leg hole right here, I tell you what, I can probably fit my meat stick in there real nice and easy like, you know what I mean? Knife gun? What's wrong? What are you doing here? What, are we in Israel or something? I'm not allowed to walk down the street? No. Yeah, you sexy little girl. I'm gonna show you how to play some Texas. That's a $20 ante right there. Each chip is worth 10. This is worth 20. Oh, you're just, That's worth 50. Juke. There's my 100. Oh, that is, you're Jew. Oh, there. Yeah, I'm gonna do one. You're the cheater. You know, you're just mad because your parents are dead. You're just trying don't, to take it out on me. Don't, think you, don't listen to him, baby. Don't listen to him. I'm sick and tired of playing this game with a bunch of amateur card players don't know what the hell they're doing. What the, get your damn hand away from there, boy. That's my goddamn Patron cup. What the hell do you think this is? There's still some beer in there. Right? There ain't no beer in there. I drank that yesterday. What the hell's the matter with you? That's 100% American dip spit, grizzly, wintergreen. What's up? I'm getting sick and tired of playing with this mm -hmm. shit, dealing yeah. with you. I'm going all in on this shit. I'm done. Finished. What you got, boy? What's your bet? Dog. You don't bet a dog. You don't bet a goddamn poodle dog. You don't bet a damn poodle dog right now. Look, man, I just, I just, just. It's, she's got to be worth like nineteen dollars. You gotta like get me in this. I got all right, you know. I'm fucking done. Done. Eighty-eight. I win. You don't win. win. You can't just win. I win. This is a goddamn. What do you saw? I got King eighty-eight. Look at all these winnings. Like I'm gonna finally get the PT Cruiser I always wanted. Hot blue. Can't fuck with this. Yeah, good for Sound my ass. Let me pray. Let me. All right. Oh, here we are. What's up? What's up? Little knife, how are you? you say, You just kind of followed me here. I was on my way here. No, you weren't. You were on your way to Joe's house? Joe? Yeah. That's where we are. We're at Joe's house. See Joe? I came here. See his house? Joe? You care if I come back in the van? Can Joe? you go away? Son, you still living in the dumpster? I'll tell you, all your tears would overflow my dumpster, and no, I moved back in with my parents. Tell you what, Matt. I'll let you back in the band if you give me that ice cream. The Jew and me didn't want to give it away. It was a dollar fifty of hard work and hustling for that eclair. But I do have my job back, being a hit singer, dolphin fuck. So I recently moved to Boston, Massachusetts uh, with my family and um, uh, we're still in Dolphin Fuck. We're still trying to keep it together uh, as webcam. Um, I'm taking some classes down, um, down at DeVry where uh, I'm studying oceanography and crustacean biology. You know, just looking at Alaskan king and snow and Veronian blue and the purple stingers and the woodpeckers. just. Oh my god, these, so many species of crab, just, you know, something okay, about them. It just, Jed, just, just one night, he, he, was try, he was trying to fuck me, okay? I was just at my house, sleeping in my own respective bed, and those beady little eyes, just touching my butt, and uh, he said, can I come in? I said, no, no, and I punched him in the nuts. And I punched him in the nuts like six times. And the whole thing with gun knife was, I was trying to suck in his dick in the middle of the night, and he didn't like it. And I'm sick and tired of trying to get his attention, you know? Yeah, I 
idea for a third drummer came to us in a dream that we were awake for. Involving an email that we received. We got this, we got this new fucker, Leslie. Fucking America! Uh, he, I guess he's the lead drummer now, I mean. I say fucking whatever, I still play harmony. I mean, when you hear something, you don't hear the lead drums, you hear the harmony. You feel it, the music that comes out of it. Other than that, he's a pretty chill dude. He don't really say too much, except like, Alex, stop puking on my drums, or Alex, will you stop urinating, please? Or Alex, that's my asshole, don't touch it. Or Alex, don't try and rape my dog. Or Alex, will you stop shitting again, please? It's disgusting. So... Uh... girl in the band, you know? We could be like Flyleaf and um, like that, that band with the red-haired singer that was naked on Twitter. New synth player. Hey guys. Yeah, new chick, right? Yeah. What was your name? Brittany. my real name. Okay. Hey, you're gonna need a new name. Okay, what, what should my new name be? Aluminum vagina. Well, I don't really have an aluminum vagina. Oh, well, that's not we entirely can't. true. We can't prove that. Okay. We'll see when the test gets back from the lab. Aluminum know. vagina, I crown ye. The aluminum vagina is a very good synth player, you know, because she has that that quality in a synth player you look for, you know, like not being plugged in. That is a very important aspect, you know? Like we're not attack attack or anything. We don't want to I like attack attack. Yeah. Yeah. I think they're pretty good. They have everything set up in the way it's <laughs> I still like attack attack. Bassist he didn't show up, so he was late. It turns out he was dead. It's like, what's the point of being in a grindcore band if all you do is hate everything about it and everyone in the band and your life and everything about your life and everyone else that's alive? What was that bass player name? Landon. Landon, Landon. Uh, he's a real quiet fucker, a goofy fucker too. A little skinny fucker as well. Oh, well, listen, you guys are not brutal enough. You know, I don't want to have to bring a fourth drummer in here. We don't need no goddamn fourth drummer. You know what, drum. because you guys are up You only need place. one drummer, you only need me. Joby Alec with his V-necks and his deep V's and his fucking V pajamas and his V thongs. This kid's all about V's all day and it ain't about getting vagina, okay? It's about getting Phoenix. Okay. Since I do everything in this band and no one actually knows how to play their instruments and bullshit, so I created myself a guitar bass prototype. I'm getting real fucking tired of Joe's stupid gimmicks and shit. He just like does all this stupid shit to get noticed, all these gay ass gimmicks, these costumes, the outfits, and just. I am not trying to use gimmicks to make the band popular. I just want the band to get noticed and be remembered based on what we're wearing. Deep V's, guys. French made costumes. Got like big clothes. What? What are you talking? I'm like the nutty professor once he turns back into Chris Rock. Joe liked to smoke pot a lot, but our parents took all of our bowls away, <clears throat> and so we've been forced to, you know, become creative with every, with everything that we've been smoking out of. Oh Jesus! This is gonna be so
I've known you. We, I've been in the band for two weeks now. Though. All right, I'm just kidding, Marcus. Did you need a hand up or something? Yeah, I need a hand. I need to get all this up before band practice tonight, and I don't know how to do any of it. Do I? I don't, I don't know how to do that. We have practice in like five minutes, and I need to get all this up. Well, you better get to work. Well, That's a lot of stuff. Yeah, I know. I need help. Do you smell that? What? Does it turn you on? No, it doesn't turn me on. It's not disgusting. Alright, man. Alright, I just pooped. Alright, <laughs> just, just so you know. See you later, Marcus. What's it like being the janitor for Dolphin Fun? I mean, it's great. I, it's a great band. I always get to see them play. I can't ask for a better job, honestly. Yeah, the janitor. Not a fan of the janitor. Uh, I mean, he tries to clean up the shit, you know, and the urine and the vomit. And we need that. It damp it. Not only does it dampen the drum sound, it, it brings this whole brutal aspect. And he tries to clean it up. We can't keep it clean. We gotta keep it sloppy. We're tuned to Z flat and then double sharp and then double F. And double F. Okay? We tune so many different tunings. I mean, you can't clean that up. It's just nasty and raw. And the janitor, he's a nice guy, you know. But, uh, you know, you can't, you can't have that in this kind of band. It's not that style. We're not that type of music. We're straight brutal. And I told you about the walls. And I told you about the shit. And I done told you everything about the goddamn band that you need to know. And I'll tell you one other thing. That gun knife is going to get fucked one day. By me. And he going to like it. Yeah!